Hi, this is Peter Dyke's Clairvoyant here, and I'm doing your astrology sign now here for Cancer for October the 3rd to, uh, to the 9th, 2022, your weekly star sign. So this is for Korea. So for Korea now, it's like I feel like you're a little bit pulled in different directions here with the Two of Swords. It's like you're not sure what you want, where you're going, or you may know what you want, where you're going, but you're not implementing because you're pulling do I, don't I. So it's like you're sitting on the edge. And that's absolutely fine. Nothing wrong with that. Maybe it gives you time to work a few more things out. But the problem is you're missing out on opportunities. You know, the more you overthink it, the more it's going to disappear into thin air. In other words, you've missed the opportunity. You've talked yourself out of it. And it's a shame. So I just feel so you need to get out there because you've got a bit of resolving to do now. And also just watch that it doesn't drain your energy. So get out there now and focus on what you want. So instead of pulling and draining your energy, get out there now and make it happen. When it comes to relationships here, um, I just feel like here now... I feel like I've got to start trusting my intuition a little bit, a little bit here. And here, it's like you've got the two balance cards coming out. So with the justice card here, you're trying to perhaps control a certain situation. But with the temperance, you're trying to find some kind of middle ground with it all. But I just feel like somebody's not telling you all the facts because you've got a little bit of secretiveness going on with this. But I also feel as though it's telling you to trust your intuition and perhaps bring a little bit of healing into the situation. And then I feel like as you do that, you'll perhaps get the best out of this person. I don't feel like they're being untrustworthy, running off with another woman or another man, if it's a female energy uh, we're focusing on here. Um, but whichever way it is, I just feel like they're just holding back a little bit, and that's a shame. Now, when it comes to family... I just feel like here, gradually things are kind of calming down. And I feel so now you've got to focus on your wishes and dreams a little bit and start to focus on what you want to say with your messenger card. So whether this is, you know, to do with children or to do with uh, outer family. But focusing on children here, I'm drawn to a young age of somebody just growing up, perhaps a very young child here. But I do get the feeling as they get older, they will grow a little bit more ambitious and quite energetic and have a kind of lot going on up here with them but I mean that in a positive way like sort of driven motivated ambitious so I feel so that's great so overall just keep moving forward I feel money's okay I can feel gradually building up and I feel health just focus on your knees and below a little bit you cancerians but overall just feel so you're doing really good and for some reason I want to pull your angel card out so do be honest with yourself and speak your truth when you've got things to say so keep doing what you're doing and bit by bit you'll get there. It's not a bad week for you.